What is going on, beautiful people? Ah, class done for the day, for the week, actually. Uh, done with class. I'm trying to get out of this parking lot here. Um, huh, well, I don't know why I made that sound like that was so difficult. Literally just had to throw her in reverse, Terry. Um, just got done with my physics lab. Uh, had physics lecture before my physics lab. Uh, so Friday is our fun-filled day of physics. Physics fun-filled Friday. Fun-filled physics Friday. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. Fun-filled physics Friday. Alliterations here. Except, you know, physics starts with a P, but still physics. <laughs> that was dumb. Uh, I spent the entire physics lab trying to learn V Python uh, for you, those who are in, uh, you know, not knowledgeable necessarily, but in tune with mechanical engineering degrees in physics 152. Uh, some just different programming things. V Python is a type of Python that you run and you can build shapes and vectors and stuff like that. It's a bunch of gibberish that if you're not a mechanical engineering major or have taken physics that you, you know, really don't understand, but it's okay. Uh, so I did that uh, in physics lecture. I'm not really sure what we even talked about. Um, oh, speed bump. Forgot about that one. Um, physics lecture, we talked about more vectors. Um, and this morning I did uh, history class. Talked about Plymouth. Plymouth, uh, Massachusetts and the colonies at Plymouth Rock and the Massachusetts Bay Company and um, just all things like that. Real fun times. Um, figured out that I'm going to be doing an H option for that class. Um, H option is like making the class honors so I get honors credit for it without it actually being an honors an honor specific class but you can make pretty much any class in honors um, so I've decided I'm going to do that um, sitting here at the stoplight this stoplight takes forever uh, it's the stoplight that connects Crescent yes Crescent Avenue with student housing on the east side campus on the west side um so, it, it it takes forever. Sorry, interrupted. Spam phone call. Uh, like I was saying, the stoplight takes a really, really long time. Uh, so, it's like sometimes like when I leave student housing to come to campus, I'll go out the backside and come in on Crescent because it's just like a lot of times it's faster going out on to Coliseum, on to Crescent, to get into campus than it is to drive all the way back through student housing and then wait on that traffic light. It takes forever. I'm telling you. Uh, but anyways, like I said, class for the week done. Uh, in about two hours, I have to meet up with my research lab group. Um, and we are going to start, be f start filling some... Uh, research systems, fish tanks, whatever you want to call them, so we can get research started up here in about three weeks. I'm really excited to start doing that. Um, hopefully the aquaponics system is good to go. I'm on this research lab more of a, uh, like, not really biology. Obviously, I'm not a biology student, so I don't do much of the biological research. I'm there more, like, if things break so I can fix them. Because, you know, you guys know I worked at a hardware store all through high school. And then I'm also in mechanical engineering. So I do have, well, should have good technical skills or whatever you want to call them skills to fix things up and make them good. Uh, also, this turn really sucks. Um, there's a super tight turn on... Uh, student housing where like if you're not watching you're definitely going to like either drill the curb or drill the car coming towards you so gotta be careful there but like i said we're going to do that got to meet up with research lab at 5 30 and then tomorrow i gotta re meet up with the research lab to clean the storeroom um not sure what daphne's going to be doing um, but yeah just another day day in the life of dawn you know that's how we do it back here. Um, yeah. 
I will I'll catch up with you guys when I have something more interesting and not really just driving through I don't see any coyotes anymore yeah that coyote was just out in the middle of nowhere right next to Daphne's building so apparent but apparently it's coyote coyote mating season so for like the next six weeks they're going to be more active is what I've been told so anyways I will catch you guys later <laughs> all right i hope you guys enjoyed that asmr <laughs> eating a king size kit kat these things are they're pretty pretty girthy uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. anyways done with the research uh lab portion for tonight tomorrow i gotta go back and clean in the morning but it's all right i'm actually so excited for this being able like you should have saw it. Like, you wouldn't think that there would be anyone in this world to be so excited about turning on a faucet of water, letting it fill up, mm -hmm. and then turning on a water pump only for pipes of fish poop to start just, mm -hmm. like, spewing everywhere. Uh -huh. I was pretty excited. I'm glad. I can't wait. I, I'm really excited, I'm if you can't glad. tell. I'm glad. Uh, but... So I got done, and then this one right here. You look like the girl from Recess. Thank you. How many of you watched Recess? Like the Disney show? Did you watch Recess ever? Mm-hmm. They always played kickball at Recess. That was like the big thing, right? Yeah. But like most of the most of the episode or whatever took place during Recess at school. That's why it was called Recess. Uh-huh. Anyways. We, uh, she wanted to get ice cream, so we got some ice cream. Uh, what'd you get? Huh? What'd you get? I got this Halo Top birthday cake, and then I got mint chocolate chip. Halo Top birthday cake. Uh-huh. And then, shit. And you got this, what? H your Farms mint cookies and cream. Yeah. 20 grams of protein in this. Yeah. But... Oh, hey, only 330 calories. It's not terrible. This has per container 19 grams of calories. I mean, not calories, <laughs> protein. Mm -hmm. This has uh, 320 calories per serving. Oh, yeah. And there's three servings in here. <laughs> so you're talking 1,000 calories in here, which this is the one I got. I got a uh, Talenti Gelato Sea Salt Caramel. What do you think is gonna be the best one? Mint chocolate chip. Mint. If it's not mint chocolate chip. Huh? You didn't get mint chocolate chip. What did I get? You got mint cookies and cream. Oh, same thing. That's no. It's not the same thing. I got mint. Mhm. Mm How many of you like mint? Uh, mint ice cream. A lot of people say like, oh, if you like mint ice cream, then just go eat frozen toothpaste. Whatever. I'm like, no, it's not the same. No. I mean, ice cream's really good. Honestly, I think this is going to take... I've never had gelato. Have you I ever? Think, no, I think it's just a fluffier ice cream. Fluffier? Oh, I'm fluffy. Uh, let's... Ah, take that. Ooh. Uh-oh. There's no, there's no seal on it. Somebody licked it. That's what I'm wondering. <laughs> Did someone lick it? I don't think anyone licked it. Does gelato have a... Uh, protection seal on it? I don't think so, sweetheart. It's weird. It doesn't have an ice cream texture. Mm-hmm. It has a texture closer to butter. You try it? Sure. It's good. Like, it's actually really good. I know gelato tends to be more expensive than ice cream. I definitely don't think it's... I mean, this was actually less expensive than 
Ben and Jerry's ice cream. Ben and Jerry's gets a little bit pricey. Yep. Um, but they had like, what rum flavored? They had rum. They had rum raisins. Mhm. F- flavor. They had bourbon. Mhm. They had a like a wine flavored ice cream there too. It was like people are getting crazy with these uh, flavors of ice cream. But fact of the day, you got Halo Top ice cream, right? Yes. Halo Top. What what year did Halo Top ice cream start production? Two thousand two and I. No, 2012, and I only saw that because I saw your phone. <laughs> 2012. Halo Top started in 2012. Uh, headquarters are located somewhere in California, I believe. Um, but Halo Top is known for being a very uh, low-calorie ice cream. Um, does it taste low-calorie? Mm-mm. No? You think it's good? I think it's good. It's only very low-calories. Mm-hmm. So... I guess the more you know, if you ever want to impress people with your knowledge of Halo Top ice cream. Uh, Halo Top, if you want to sponsor us, that would be, that'd be great. Mm-hmm. Send me your ice cream. I'll eat it. I'll give my honest opinion. <laughs> She'll eat it. I won't even get to try it. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that is going to wrap it up for today folks i hope you guys have enjoyed today's vlog if you did don't be afraid hit the like button down below hit the subscribe button if you haven't hit the share button share with everyone you know let everyone know about these vlogs we're having a blast making it well i am she's not i never said that (laughs) and i hope to see all of you tomorrow on another day in the life of a dawn vlog